When people present for treatment with gambling issues, then, then really we need to look at the whole person. Uh, just looking at someone, uh, someone's gambling issue doesn't really address everything that's going on for that person. Um, so people can have a number of different things happening at the same time. They could have uh, family and relationship issues and that could be impacting on their gambling. Um, they could have uh, mental health issues, um, issues like anxiety and depression, um, which could also impact on the gambling and, and vice versa. Um, so really when we're, when we're treating people or supporting people or trying to offer some kind of um, care for people who, who might present with gambling issues, um, then we really need to look at the whole person. We, we need to look at an integrated um, approach. And that, that flows right down from the individual clinician, the mental health professional who works with that person, right through to the service itself. So services uh, need to adopt a, a more integrated approach. Some of them do already, um, but actually looking at a number of different issues and assessing for a number of different issues um, is the way to go.